In this video today, I'm going to show you how you can create clickable links inside of Canva so that you can share your templates, your digital products with your customers. So once somebody's bought a digital product or anything from you, you want to be able to give them access to that digital product. Now, this doesn't matter whether you're selling on Etsy or whether you're selling from your website or whichever platform. We want to create a link so that it gives access to that customer, anything that they've purchased. So first of all, I'm going to show you how you can create a template link inside of Canva to share a customizable template. And secondly, hang around till the end and I'll show you how you can create many links on one document so that you can optimize your marketing efforts as well as delivering products. I'll also show you how you can get your hands on this template for free so that you can also promote your business, your website, whatever you want to promote, as well as delivering those digital products. And it's a gorgeous, memorable template to give to your customers. So let's jump into Canva. So imagine that you've created this social media template pack. You're going to sell it so that people can brand it in their own colours by clicking on here, changing the colours, changing the fonts, changing the information. But you've created this pack and you want to share all of these templates with them. It's one document and you want to share it once they've purchased from you. So to be able to do this, you go to share here. And currently, as this video has been made, you can do this on a free account and pro account. Go to this arrow up here, share across to see all, and it's the template link that you want. It has got the crown there, but I'll show you on my free account that currently you can do this. So template link, create template link, copy. That now is copied to clipboard, that link there. So if I go over to a different browser now, because I've got my Canva account opened in Safari, if I go over to Firefox, this is a different account with Canva. This is a free account. and if I click in here, share that link, that now says a template was created by Elaine Park and it's shared with you. So I can now use this template for a new design. That now drops it into my free account. And if I refresh my account, you'll see that those templates are now in there. So say, for instance, I wanted to share my Halloween Instagram pack, social media highlights. Remember, again, this is my free account. I go to share, I go to template link. I go to copy, that's now copied it to clipboard. So if I go now over to the browser where my pro account is, copy that in there, again, it will give me the template link. So I've done that from my free account. So again, click on that link. The template opens inside my paid Canva account. Let's just go to home and then you can see that it's in there. And there it is ready for me to click on and use. So that's how we create a template link inside of Canva to share a template with somebody that will not overwrite your original template. It just means that they can then add that into their Canva account and then they can alter it as they like. Now, secondly, we have a document like this. This is something that I give to my customers once they've purchased a very similar document and it's got links in here to my digital products or anything that they've purchased. They can, you can download anything here. And of course, you can customise this. You could add another box you could add another box here line it all up you could take one away you can do whatever you want with this add your own logo in there and basically customize this how you'd like this now makes the purchase of your digital products or anything else that they bought from you seamless and also memorable because it's a beautiful link sheet it's got your business information on it it's got your social media handles here you can also put a link here to a landing page so that you can get them to sign up for your free offer. You can also send them to your Etsy shop or your website and give them information about your course, membership. It's limitless what you could do. You could even send them to any content that you want them to consume. It makes it easy for the customer and it's going to keep you front of mind. And it's a tangible document that says that your products are quality and a really pleasant experience for the customer. So here's what I send to my customers when they purchase anything from me, any digital products. First of all, I have the image here of what they've purchased. I thank them for their order. I also tell them that they can download below. I also have an image here and where they can click to download my free guide. So that takes them to a landing page where they can sign up to this free guide. Also, I'll leave the link below for that free guide where you can grab that 15 trends to sell big in 2025 on Etsy. And they're proving to be bang on the nail. There's also as well as the trend ideas in there. There's also lots of product ideas that you can create. Then that's telling them that click on here and that's where you can get your download. And also here I give away free Tumblr wraps with any purchase. So I put the link there as well. If you click on there, that's where the link is. 
And again, I had the link to the download in there. So if we go back to this document, and again, I'll leave all the details below of how you can get this for free. What you would do here, click on this, click on the three dots, go to link, and in here you'll put the link to your landing page so that they can sign up for your freebie. You might also in there go to the three dots again, go to the link, put the link to your Etsy shop in there. So what I do is load my digital products that I've created onto my Google Drive. I can then share a link from my Google Drive. So I go here to the three dots if I want to share that image. Share, get link. And here you change this here to, you have to change this to anyone with the link. It'll be unrestricted when you first see it. Click on there. Anyone with the link, copy link. Okay, so I've now copied the link. I go back to my document in Canva. I click on here, I go to the three dots, I go to link, and then I copy and paste that link into here. When I'm happy with all my links, I've linked to my YouTube channel there, I've linked to my Instagram. Again, do the same thing. Link and put your Instagram link in there. And click done when it's done. Now we have to download this as a PDF. If you download it as a PNG, it will not work. You have to go up here, download this as a PDF and then download. That way when I click onto that download it then takes me to the link in the Google Drive. So once we have our document, our PDF, we can add it in here where it says digital files so that that automatically gets delivered to the customer once they purchase from Etsy or if you're selling from your website or another platform Upload your PDF into your Google Drive, go to the three dots, share, get link, anyone with the link, copy the link, and then your customer has that link to that sheet. So if I copy and paste that link in here, and then when they click here, they can access the digital product that they've purchased. So a quick recap, you can share your template links here, go to share, template link, and then copy that link and give that link to your customer so that they can have the link to this without overwriting anything that you've done. Or you can create a document like this that has links to various different things, download it as a PDF and give that to your customer with all your links on. And if you'd like a copy of that free links document, I'll leave the link below so that you can grab that and customize it for selling your own digital products. I'll also leave that link below to the free guide, 15 trends and designs predicted to be big in 2025. So you can grab that and links that I think will be helpful for you on your journey, growing your digital product business. So go watch these videos next, five Canva AI design features that you should know about. And also this one, how to create digital products fast inside of Canva. I'll see you in the next one.